Hello folks, what's up? Welcome back to another episode of World of Tanks. We are already at the battlefield with uh, our TT-130M and today, guess what? We're gonna carry some battles, yeah. <laughs> Somehow that's also possible with this vehicle. Uh, about which I can say that in compared to every other tier 9 heavy tank I played with, this tank is still kind of underperforming so maybe I'm not sure but I heard some strange stories that maybe Wargaming is gonna show some love uh, pretty soon to this vehicle and believe me that's more than needed if you want this tank to to work properly because yeah it should have some armor you can bounce shots but even fully aimed shots like this one you're gonna a you're gonna miss a lot of times and that can be pretty frustrating so we grab this position here and we'll try to farm something of course first 500 into y tank uh tier 7 of course you notice that i'm shooting apcr as well yeah because even with them, you'll see in this video that uh, you can bounce some unrealistic situations. I think that's gonna be the moment right now. Well, no, probably next one. So I noticed that those standard shells are not even decent. So. Okay, that was uh, that was a snapshot I missed here, and we are losing zero to four, and I'm trying to trying to find an angle here and trying to protect my cupola. I'm aiming this shot here, and with premium round, I'm bouncing frontally, lower plate or somewhere near. Maybe even upper plate, never mind, of tier 7 tank. <clears throat> I mean, come on. But here I didn't want to stand there. That they can aim at my weak spot and shoot at it. So I took my chance and once again I missed my shot. So how many rounds and just three penetrations? Luckily. <laughs> so 0 to 5. For enemies, we are somewhere around 2k. Yeah, this looked promising for me in this moment because I saw that we're not that bad with hit points. Here I'm gonna try to find that commander's hatch of KV-122 and luckily I managed. So we have this tier 7 heavy, Borsig at the top and let's see can we make this shot yes 500 straight into borsic side already around 3k awesome let's go in front and i guess let's try to win this battle still losing right now six to three kind of equal with hit points which is pretty good for us because we are on full hp and look at this right now i went there I wanted to trade, I wanted to give him opportunity to take his shot and punish me, but I fully aimed my shot and I missed. So, yeah, this tank is really a headache. So I, I think I, I got a couple of tens of white hair on my head playing this, I think, 50, 60 rounds with it because... It was pretty frustrating, believe me. Right now I'm just checking because I didn't want to receive some side shots. Pretty often they are like ammo racks when they're playing with this vehicle. Right now I'm gonna wait and try to find an angle to punish that Borsig without receiving a shot. Luckily I'm managing to first kill. 
3.2k but our enemies are capturing the base <clears throat> what we have here in front of us we can manage easily i'm thinking and yeah we can see that our gsor is uh, fulfilled with pr frustration and soon i'm gonna tell something to my team like defend <laughs> something similar because i just didn't want to lose this one immediately i went in front never mind i'm gonna receive some damage i just wanted to do as much as possible here because i wasn't sure are we gonna defend this or enemy is gonna cap <clears throat> more than 4k damage fully aimed shot missed of course let's go in front and yeah i'm yelling defend to my team Hopefully they will. Once again, let's aim our shot fully. He backed a bit. He went back a bit, but okay. Still losing. Just 15 seconds to go. 10 to 8, 3k in minus with hit points. Come on, can we do that? Couple of seconds, I'm, of course, missing my shot to enemy light tank, but enemy tanks stopped with capture or our teammates just decapped i think first situation is uh, bigger possibilities for first situation that enemy just stopped with capture they thought eh, we're gonna win this easily but here i'm not sure where's that object 257 that's why i stopped for for the moment and uh, I'm spotted, but from who? Yurez is here, punishing him for less than 500, and I went in front immediately, thinking maybe I'm gonna ram him here, but you can see how. Yeah, I'm barely turning when I'm using those rocket boosters. 5.3k till now, three kills. And right now I'm potential one shot for that object 257. Somehow we managed to be in this 14 to 11 situation. And I guess that's just because uh, we have a lot of, uh, I don't know how to call them, bots or noobs uh, in uh, enemy team especially you're gonna see after this battle ends that uh, this object 257 for sure isn't human and i was but i didn't know that in this this situation so i was trying here to peek at this corner to check and this is just a situation he he's looking at that side he's checking tvp vtu nothing Nothing special. He is not shooting. He is just chilling here and waiting to be farmed. So, once again, bro, or is this computer program or, or what the hell? Thanks a lot for those two shots. And right now, we managed to pick that Brothers in Arms medal with Lorraine 40T. Awesome stuff. More than 6k damage. A little bit less than 2k we blocked. Not that bad, yeah but uh, well, when you look at it like this but uh, i can tell you something for sure you're gonna be struggle you're gonna be struggling a lot uh against tier 10s and some tier 9s in potential matchup uh to have a result similar like this one is this is nothing special so what was that six point around 6.2k damage but the thing is, once again, I said already, this tank, in compared to every other tier 9 heavy I played with, this tank is really underperforming. So you're missing your shots. If you're shooting standards, you're just uh, bouncing some... Uh, like you have a shot here on this Tiger. So side, you're going to bounce that. It's going to be a critical hit a lot of times, believe me and it's so frustration i mean full f every single round you you play with this tank you'll find some moment in which you're gonna feel feel frustrated how so well 
it's how it is. I choose this tank because I already said I have uh, that BZ58 slash 2 on my other account and I didn't want to play with that tank again because it's for me it's similar like uh, uh, 50 TP I also played with a lot of times and I wanted something new and a lot of a lot of guys are comparing this tank to that and me also uh, comparing this tank with the uh, WZ-114, but let me tell you something. WZ-114 have has minus 10 gun depression, has bigger alpha, alpha damage, bigger penetration value with standard shells. So if you're thinking of purchasing this tank for 20 tokens, think five times, you can do that just because I did it, for example. I just wanted to have something uh different in my garage but believe me folks you can see that i played 60 battles 61 battle actually in this vehicle and this is the best battle i played in it so i'm i performed around 2.6k combined this is craziness and believe me every single battle you're losing credits because of course you need to shoot uh, premium ammunition because with those standard shells i mean they just don't work so, story of this tank is, oh, painful, painful as F, one big F. Our battle results are showing that uh, this wasn't enough for Mastery Badge uh, Ace Tanker, so just class 1. Still all high caliber confederate and uh, brothers in arms we picked with our uh, Lorraine 40T. You can see that we farm pretty much a lot uh, when you compare this result with uh, our with, with the results our teammates had and with the results uh, our enemies had and what I mentioned also that object 257 at the end who uh, I think we took two shots on him is not a human that's for sure so this is a bot program 100% so in a lot of situations unfortunately nowadays we have those type of uh, <clears throat> call it players but they they're not players and luckily for me in this situation this type of uh, play helped me to reach this point of six point let's call it uh, 6.2k damage because a uh, couple of times i managed that around 5k game 5.2 5.3 also against tier nines and tier tens but that was that was a big really big pain in the ass and uh, as i already mentioned this tank uh, if you receive some shot from in your side armor like this you're gonna get ammo wrecked i don't know how many times uh, your gun uh, can be damaged like three four times per battle how's that possible uh, i don't know really also so this is one really strange vehicle, really strange vehicle. I think one of the strangest vehicles I played until now. But, once again, there is always that. But, uh, I heard some interesting stories that soon Wargaming is going to give some buffs to this vehicle. Because a lot of players and those famous uh, content creators uh, complained a lot about this vehicle. Because 20 tokens for something like this... Uh, tank underperforming like this tank is underperforming in tier 9 insanity but all in all we managed to carry some games with it and as i said in my previous video i'm gonna showcase <clears throat> one of those carries uh, in those moments after those moments I, I i reached that point so this is it folks i hope that you like it if you did play please jump on those buttons because with those couple of clicks you're gonna help uh, my channel grow and of course that means a lot to me if you have some possible <laughs> possible uh, advices and like uh, interventions <laughs> uh, for this tank, for example, why what what you suggest about equipment modules and so on, type of play and so on, please write down in comments below. Maybe that's gonna be helpful for me because I don't know. I mean, I I'm planning to play a couple of tens battles, maybe. 20 30 bells more in this vehicle and i'm just gonna stop there because 
maybe if in some sooner future war gaming will show some love to this vehicle then for sure i'm gonna come back and try it once again but just a couple of more battles and i'm stopping there it's enough really <laughs> enough white hair on my head <laughs> folks that's it for today i hope that you enjoyed it my tt130m carry voila <laughs> Stay smiled, stay focused, of course, snipe good. Kisses from Alex and Channel Grind together. See you tomorrow with some new tanks. GG folks, bye bye. Till next time.